you are someone who's always been very much of an activist. Yes. You've, you've never just kind of done your job yes. and, and sat there. You have been very active with the CFDA in Fashion Targets Breast Cancer, right. raising money for the Central Park Zoo. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. So first of all, let's talk about Fashion Targets Breast Cancer. Well, how did that, how did that, that come that about? That happened because we had a very famous editor. Fashion Targets Breast Cancer be became a reality because a woman named Nina Hyde, who was one of our great fashion editors from Washington, D.C., died of, of, of breast cancer. And it just be, suddenly became a cause. The first person that really backed it, and I give him most credit for it, was Ralph Lauren. Mm -hmm. He really got behind it, but he used the CFDA as well. Between, we went to Washington, we went, and, and that, so that became, and it still is one of our major yes. fundraisers. Uh, I, I, I'm, I guess by my nature an activist, I, I'm on the board of Bryant Park, I'm on the board of the fashion uh, bid, I'm, I've, I've been on community boards. I was president of my fraternity, what do you do about that? <laughs> I mean, I, I just am a, I'm a good, also I think I'm a good worker with people. I, I can take the pawns and the brooks and, the, the, and put them all together in some sort of perspective. And I look back at my life and see that I've done that very well. I never knew I was doing it, but I think I did it very well. I think you did. That's why I love QVC so much. QVC came into my life just at a time when I needed it. They didn't need me, but I needed it emotionally. And, and I talked about Broadway. It, it helped looking at the camera and so knowing that people were there. I wasn't camera shy. I was a lover of it. I never knew I was. Of course I knew. Of course I knew it was. I wanted to be in showbiz. <laughs> of course I knew. But I think you were born to yeah, it, Stan. I, I, I guarantee. Were. Here I'm sitting here. Where's the camera? Where's the camera? Give, oh, I there guarantee. It is. is that where it's been? Well, but but I think that's a part of the QVC world. I mean, the fact that we sit there and the and the and the people sit out there and they respond to you both negatively and positively. Mm -hmm. But they do. I answer as much as I can the letters that come to me. I, I'm sort of, you know, like their cozy guy. Uh, but what a wonderful thing that is to have, you know? Oh, yeah. Better than sitting on the racks in some department store. Oh, yeah. It's, it's a, uh, my friends, of course, not everybody wants to be on QVC, and, and good for them if they can get on, but who needs them? I don't want them here. That's right. <laughs> All we need is Stan Herman all the time. Right, right, right. All Stan, Stan right. TV. Right, all, right. all Stan but all the then, time. I, and I mean, people like you, I mean, you're the, the hosts on the show are just extraordinary. I mean, how they do what they do. People always ask me, how do they do what they do? I said, well, that's their, that's their fach. That's what they, that's what they're trained to do. And, yeah. and it's such a beautiful thing to be able to sell fashion mm -hmm. and beauty mm -hmm. on television and have people react because once they get it, they like it, and they tell you that. Yeah. And if they don't like it, they, they tell, tell you, you that. that. Yeah. Yes. Very, yeah. very vocal. <laughs> yes. 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 But very educational. Oh, too. it's wonderful. Yes. And, and sometimes I get a letter from a woman who said just the opposite of the next person. Right. I hated that print. I love that print. It was too big in the hip. It was too small in the hip. But that—that's the beauty of of, right. of, of this of this wonderful world. Well, whenever we're on the air, speaking of QVC, <clears throat> yes. one of the things that I love yes. is that whenever someone calls in, you ask what their sign is. Oh, I do. So let's talk about this oh, whole history God. with the Zodiac. I mean, how does this, because oh. it, it's hysteria. I mean, you are so I consistent know. and it is so I much know. fun and it's something that we all love. But Well, sometimes I can guess their sign from their voice. On, on, I've seen I you know, do it. I know. Yeah. I'm not an expert. I do have somebody who, who, who follows my life. I don't live my life by it. I find it so, it, it's almost like a shockwave of recognition. Um, I think people look like their signs. I think you have a lot of water in your face. You're a water sign. I'm very much the Virgo, uh, close eye set, uh, features that stay younger than usual. Water signs age differently than than air. So I, oh, I selfishly, do water signs age well? I really uh, selfish like right now. Uh, they, well, if they if they're you, they do. <laughs> <laughs> if they have as many skincare products as I do in my bathroom. <laughs> but well, water signs age differently. I I uh, uh, I don't live my life by it. I you know I know why I do it. I know when I had my big business on Seventh Avenue, I would come out and sometimes look at a buyer, and I'd say, you know, you're a cancer. And she'd say, oh, how did you find? And she had a bigger order. She'd write a bigger order. Oh, <laughs> so, so I but think there that, is, yeah. I mean, it's, it really, it really is. It's one of those things where you feel like, wow, he gets me. It's, it, it's the elements. It's yeah. the earth, fire, air, water. 
each element is, is different. We have, in this room we have, I said, but we have water, water, fire taking the big shot. The producer's the fire sign, which makes a lot of sense to me. It does. Yes, a yes. lot of sense. It does. So I don't know. I don't know. So why. it's just something you've kind of always enjoyed. Yeah, I enjoy it. I yeah. enjoy it. And this very serious friend of mine, who is a serious uh, uh, artist when it comes to horoscope, also an ex-Jesuit, uh, somebody who really wow. knows. Can I meet that person? Yeah, anytime. That sounds really he interesting. He would love it. He's fabulous. But he, he treats it as as, as a, a very serious. Uh, 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 condition that, that the world, I mean, I don't want to talk about the world in the future, but, right. this, but uh, he's, he's a, a wonder, and there are people who are. I don't live my life by it, but I don't not live my life by it. Well, I have to say, I always enjoy it. Uh, always. Whenever you come on, it's so much fun.